Hello guys, welcome back to Tech Help with Akshat and today I'm back with a new video. But before I talk about my video, let me wish you all a very Merry Christmas and an upcoming Happy New Year. And I'm a friend of mine who wants to wish you guys too, Spidey. Merry Merry Christmas to all of you and a Happy New Year. Ha. I was a great fan of this guy and I'm still a great fan of this guy. In fact, I keep digging when his movies will come out and his new movies are upcoming soon in 2017. Anyways, let's get back to the topic. And the topic that I've chosen for my video today is a kind of treat for some of the games or the apps lover out there. I know most of you guys know how to do it, but for those who don't, the topic I've chosen for today is how to download the paid apps on the Google Play Store for free. Sounds pretty crazy and insane, right? Like Google has invested billions of dollars on its security. Like how can you bypass the security and download the paid apps without paying anything from the Google Play Store? Well, actually it's not kind of possible from the Google Play Store itself, but there are some third party websites which will help you download these apps for free. and. In most cases, they run perfectly on any device whatsoever. So without any further ado, let's get started. Okay guys, now just follow what I do and I'm sure you'll be able to get most of the apps running on your device. So first of all, let's go to Play Store and let's search for app that space, say GTA Vice City. Now you can see it's it costs 300 rupees. I'm sure you don't want to pay 300 rupees for a game on the mobile. Uh, so the and in fact there are many games on Google Play which aren't available anymore for the users in, and in India or some specific, uh, specific countries. So um, there is a website known as mob mob.org mob.org and you can see as soon as it opens you will get all games, live wallpapers, apps wallpapers, ringtones, and many more items, okay? So, this is the third-party website that I was talking about. You can easily find almost all the apps uh, you want or all the games that you want to play as long as you know how to install those apps on your device. So, first of all, let me tell you, you don't need to root your device whatsoever. This method of playing the games on your device does not require to root your device. You'll find many videos telling you need to root your device or something like that. Well, this is a root-free method. So if you don't want to root your device, you can follow this method. And even if you are on a rooted device, you can follow this method. Okay, let's search for a game. Say, uh, I'm very fond of a game called Limbo. It's not available anymore on Play Store. I don't know why. It's a pretty interesting game. So let's search for Limbo. Okay, here you go. Limbo version 1.15. You'll get most of the latest version out here. Okay, so let's just select the game. And you can see the page opens up like this. All right. So what you need to do is just scroll down to the bottom and read the instructions once. Okay, it will tell you what the game is about, what the game features are, and it tells you that the game requires the cache to be downloaded. Now what exactly is this cache? You have seen that when downloading games like Asphalt, most of you must have downloaded Asphalt on a device. So you have seen that the APK is pretty small, but then when you launch the app, they download something like 1.5 or 2 GB. So that 1.5 of the 2 GB that gets downloaded is what exactly is the cache file. So what this website does for you is it, it brings the APK and also the cache separately onto the same space. So you need, you can download both of them separately and then get them running. Just see, just follow what I do. So go to download and select one of the versions. For example, if you want the modded version, modded versions are generally with unlimited coins or lives or something like that. So if you want to play fair, you can download the fair version. Okay, and remember this is one game where you are finding only one version, but there might be some games like Vice City where you might find multiple versions of the game, like version 1.0.3, version 1.0.7, and the corresponding game caches also below. So those game caches will also be corresponding to the APKs that you will find on top. Like one thing you need to note here is that if you are downloading an APK for version 1.1.5, then the game cache also needs to be of the same version otherwise there might be some compatibility issue and your data might go in waste if you're on data of course or your time might go in waste if you're on wi-fi so make sure that the version of the apk and the version of the game cache matches out otherwise i'm pretty sure the game won't run properly so what you need to do is just go ahead and click on download torrents don't work properly nowadays so better download it directly so just click on download 
and you see it comes to download something like this I've already downloaded it or right. so I won't download it again now also download the game cache click on download again it will give you an instruction download if you are using UC browser what you need to do next is now go to your explorer go to the UC browser uh, UC downloads I'm sorry the UC downloads folder and you will get both of them here like limbo.zip this is the game cache file and uh, let me find where is that apk that I downloaded just now and here's the apk you see for limbo.apk so what you need to do first is I would recommend that before installing this apk go ahead and unzip this file I use ES explorer for unzipping files is better so just click on ES zip viewer it takes some time to open up I don't know why so you will see that this is the data file which we are talking about so what you need to do is just extract this let's extract it to choose the path for extraction okay let's extract it to the SD card that is the root folder of your device the main uh, window that's displayed when you open the explorer so now you can see the files have been extracted out here uh, let me find it it's pretty confusing oh. it was something like com dot so it must be in C right uh, yeah com dot play dot limbo dot pool so what you need to do is go ahead select this file cut or move it to Android and OBB and paste it inside this folder. Click on paste. There you go. Play that limbo or full has been copied. Now go ahead and install the APK which you downloaded. So it's installing, might take some time. Uh, guys, I'm really sorry for my voice quality if it's sounding awful. I'm, I don't have a proper mic. I'm sorry for that. And uh, let's wait for this app to install. It's installed. Now click on open. And there you see the game's running pretty well. I hope so. It runs well. It hasn't run yet. It's still loading. All right, let's wait for this game to open up. All right, it will give me a Google sign in, I suppose. So, guys, don't be afraid to sign into Google. They are not able to catch you in most of the time. See, it can't connect to Google Play at all. That means this game is totally pirated. So, there you see the game's running pretty well. And uh, guys, I would recommend you to play this game. This is a pretty interesting game, actually. Test your brain to quite some limit. Better than playing those violent games like San Andreas and all. So the game is started. There you see our main character. His name is Limbo. He wakes up. Wake up fast, guy. You're too slow. Might be killed by the crabs or the swamps out there. Alright, so you got him. Okay, so this is how you need to do. He jumps. So you can see the game is running pretty well. There are no issues whatsoever. So this is the process that you need to follow to install any game whatsoever. So be it GDA Vice City, for example, if you don't want to download GDA Vice City, just search for GDA Vice City out here, okay? Just go here. GTA Vice City. You see, this is version 1.0.7. Just go down. Search the download button. Here you see download. Again, the same thing. Just match this. Uh, also, make sure that it's compatible with your Android version. You might be on uh, KitKat and you download one which is compatible only with Lollipop and above, so it won't work on a device. So, just Android 2.3. I suppose I download version 1.0.7. Now, you see that there are two game caches version 1.0.6 and version 1.0.7. So, if you download version 1.0.7's APK, make sure to download was 1.0.7 game cache and then the process is exactly the same which I've done for limbo just go ahead extract the data file or the game cache and copy that extracted folder into your android slash obb paste it inside it all right then go ahead install your apk and then your game must run pretty well so that's all for today guys I'll uh, if you have any kind of doubts just uh, ask me in the comment section below I'll give a brief description in the description of course and uh, do like comment and subscribe to my video okay and stay tuned for further more videos all right so have a great christmas and a new year